What's up guys? It's me, your girl Elisa from StylishCurves.com and today your girl is back with a new video. Uh, 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 uh. <laughs> so for today's video, I am going to be showing you guys everything that I bought from the Target designer collaboration with Christopher John Rogers, Alexis, and Rixo. So if you want to see all the cute stuff that I got, you guys already know what to do. And that is to keep on watching, yeah baby. did this huge designer dress collaboration with three designers Christopher John Rogers Alexis and Rixo Christopher John Rogers is a collection that everybody wanted something from and his pieces really sold out quickly I'm going to show you the four dresses that I picked up I picked up two from Christopher John Rogers and I also picked up two from Alexis. These were dresses that I really wanted and that I felt like I could wear over and over again without someone saying, oh, is that that Target designer collaboration dress? <laughs> you know, sometimes with these collaborations, the pieces be so good and so statement making that basically people can point them out from a mile away. But I honestly just wanted pieces that I knew that I really loved, I liked, and that I could use in my wardrobe and get multiple wears so let's get into the first piece because honey i am wearing the fabulousness so the first dress i'm wearing is a christopher john rogers dress when i saw this dress i knew i wanted it first of all the puff shoulders the puffy sleeves you guys know that is my judge I love that kind of detail because I feel like it gives dresses that little extra um. I also like that this dress had this faux wrap in the front on the skirt part. I thought that was cute. It also has pockets on the side. And then in the back, it has uh, a, a little smock detailing on the back. But other than that, there's no stretch in this dress. And I just thought that this was a really chic piece. And then of course, you guys, the color. This neon green or yellow <laughs> this is definitely giving highlighter vibes and i just think that this is just so chic and i felt like and i knew not even felt like i knew that this was going to be a piece i'm going to wear over and over and you really wouldn't even know where i got this dress from because the silhouette is such a classic type of silhouette now with the christopher john rogers i had to size up i was studying those models i was um <laughs> looking at the cut i was reading the descriptions like okay is this stretch in here and a lot of his pieces did not have stretch so i said you know what let me size up i just really just thought that this was just a beautiful color and just all of the details now the material on this it says that it is 100 cotton but the feel of this kind of feels a little bit like taffeta. And you know the other thing about this dress, it really kind of gives me 80s prom vibes, right? Am I lying? Let me know in the comment section. It gives me 80s prom vibes, but 2000s. <laughs> so again, I love this. This I'm gonna keep. So I got this in a 24, 26. Typically in dresses, I'm a 20, sometimes a 22, but like I said, I sized up and I'm glad I did. Now, I added my own belt just to show you like what it could look like, but this is what it looks like without the belt. I'm sorry for all the noise, guys. I'm filming during the day and it's like so much going on outside right now. So this is the dress without the belt. So as you can see, it has this empire waist here, and I do have a little room. It does fit really good in the bust. You can still wear a bra with it, because I do have on a bra. And in the back, in the back you have this smock detail here. So if I was to get my true size, I think it would have been too tight at the top. And this is the kind of dress that I feel like is wedding worthy. Like if you're invited to a nice summer wedding, this is a perfect dress for that. Or like a really fancy event. This is the perfect dress. So this one was a winner in my book. 
Let me know what you guys think about it, but I thought this was right on the money. All right, guys, so next up is another dress from Christopher John Rogers. And this dress is the one I wanted the absolute most out of everything that I saw. I was immediately drawn to all of the beautiful colors in here. In this dress, I'm serving you Stepford Wife from Brooklyn. <laughs> That's what I'm serving. This is just like so girly and I, I don't know, I just really love the vibe of this dress. It has a belt, has a fabric belt, and I love that it has belt loops through it so you didn't have to like just tie it. You can make it as tight or as loose as you want. And this dress also has pockets. It's such a beautiful dress. Christopher John Rogers collection really brought it with the colors. He brought it with the colors and also he really gave you that avant-garde type of fashion, like that editorial type of fashion. And so with this particular dress, I have one issue, one issue with this and it's, it has tool under the, under the skirt. So you get the fabric part of this, but inside there's literal tool under here. So it's adding extra volume, as you can see around my midsection. And then if I turn to the side, <laughs> you see the volume here and volume at the top of my booty. It's like a booty on top of a booty. So when you already have a big booty, you don't want another booty on top of your big booty. <laughs> and I hate that it has this. It is not my thing. Now, I know a lot of girls who got this dress and they love that. I don't. I just feel like this is, it's not for me, the extra value. However, I love this dress so much that I'm going to take it to my tailor and I'm going to see if he can remove the tool under here and it can just lay flat. I love the length of this. It hits below the knee on me. So I'm five foot seven and a half. So that's where it hits me. I think that's a really good length. It's more like a midi dress on me. I also love that the straps are thick enough to definitely wear a bra with. You just want to make sure you do like a skinny strap type of bra with it. Uh, you can do white and I think you would be fine or you can do a strapless. I just rolled my bra straps down for this one. This is how it looks from the back. I want to know what do you guys think about this? Should I keep it? Should I return it? Or like does it look good with the, the tool under it? Let me know in the comment section below. Alright guys, so if you are enjoying this video so far, make sure you hit that thumbs up and also hit that subscribe button down below along with the notification bell so you can be notified every time I upload a new video. Also, if you are not, make sure you're following me on Instagram at Stylish Curves. You can see how I style some of these dresses and also just follow me on what I do on a daily basis and check out my weekly outfits. So make sure you're following Stylish Curves on Instagram. Now, let's get into this blue cutie right here. So this is the dress that I got from Alexis. So I, to my surprise, because I was caught up in all of the uh, Christopher Rogers hype, I really didn't look at other stuff. And when I did, I was so surprised at the pieces that I really love from Alexis. She has some really nice like feminine type of dresses, nice and flowy and flirty. So when I saw this one, I was like, okay, that's the one I want to get because it's a mini dress but it has these really nice billowy sleeves. This one is a perfect mini on me. Like, it's, like I said, I'm five foot seven and a half. So it hits me right above the knee. And I love, look, it has ruffle details at the hem. It is a drop waist. It's just such a pretty dress. Look at how flowy, look at all of the movement in this. And it's a nice, soft, kind of silky fabric. It's just a beautiful dress. I love this belt. This has a, this is a rope belt. This belt is going to be worn with so many other things. I love that it has that rope belt. I'm glad she didn't give us like a matching, you know, fabric tie waist belt. I love that it was something a little more different. And this is how it looks from the back. So it is short, but I still feel like I get enough, you know, booty coverage in this. <laughs> and I love that it's high neck. Let me know what you guys think. So next up is this gorgeousness of a dress. This is also from the designer Alexis. I told you I really was digging her pieces. Again, feminine, flirty, girly, chic, 
all of that. <laughs> this dress is banging. I don't care if anybody doesn't like it. I think this dress is banging. This is also another dress that is wedding guest worthy. So again, if you have a wedding coming up, this right here is definitely stunting on folks at that wedding. <laughs> I love this dress because I just think it is so pretty. Look at all of the pretty pink and fuchsia colored florals in it. I also love the details on this. You got all of these tear ruffles on it. So it's like three layers, right? Three or four layers of ruffles. Then you get this asymmetrical hemline. So it's shorter on this side and then longer on this side. Then you get the asymmetrical neckline. So you got the one sleeve, you know, no sleeve on one side. And then you get this sleeve, which is nice and billowy. And it's also sheer. I love this dress. Look, this is definitely dance all night dress. You know, hit them with a all night long, all night. Hey, listen, I know I was also a little bit, so I would definitely be tearing that dance floor up. <laughs> now, this dress, I should have gotten my true size in. I was not sure if this dress had stretch, and it doesn't. The way that this dress is cut, it's actually, it actually has a generous cut. So the top part of this dress is too big. What I did was I pinned down the side just for the video so you guys could see. But I would just again take this to my tailor and have him take it in. Now I just threw on this belt with it. I do feel like it does need a belt. Now I actually had a, a belt that matched the pink in here. But I think a fuchsia colored belt would really make this pop even more. I just think this is such a pretty dress. I'll show you what it looks like without the belt. So without the belt, it does have this empire stretch waist uh, right under the bust. And so if I would have realized that, I definitely would have gotten my true size in this, which would be the 2022. Like I said, I sized up. So I'm going to first probably go back to Target and see if maybe they have the 2022 in store. But if not, I'll take it to the tailor and have him nip it in for me. So as you can see, it is extra room. And then like I said, I just have it pinned down on the side. Uh, this is how it looks from the back. It's really nice from the back. This is just a gorgeous dress. I mean, beautiful. You know what? And it does look good without the belt as well. But I, it would look even better with that waist like really nipped in. Um, I do have on a strapless bra. I'll link it down below. This is from Cacique. Ooh, look at this. Look at the movement. Let me know what you guys think about this dress. I think it is fabulous. All right, guys, so that is it for me. I hope that you enjoyed today's video. There will be links down below to everything that I showed you today. Yes, a lot of the stuff, again, is sold out, but there are going to be returns and stuff like that. So I'm going to link it, so you should definitely make sure you check it out just in case your size might be available. And what I've also noticed that Target does is depending on the area you live in or the state, they might have specific dresses at certain stores that can be shipped to you. So again, just click the links down below and check out, or obviously you can just go in store. If you wanna see how I really style some of these pieces, definitely make sure you're following me on Instagram at Stylish Curves. And if you wanna check out more plus size style, fashion, and beauty, make sure you check out the blog, stylishcurves.com. Thank you guys so much for checking out today's video. Don't forget to hit that like button. Also hit that subscription button down below along with the notification bell so you can be notified every time I upload a new video. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.